guys and welcome to my channel and to today's video um so today i'm going to be testing out the kvd beauty everlasting liquid lipsticks um so i haven't got all of the shades i've just got three and these are kind of my three absolute go-to shades so we've got a bright red shade like a maroony dark reddy shade and then also a nudie shade i don't know why i couldn't get my words out there um so yeah i'm gonna go ahead and swatch them all for you and i have used these once before actually and i was honestly so so impressed with these lipsticks like they dry down completely they're transfer proof which is what i was looking for so i tested it with a mask and like you can see my tiktok video if you want to actually so i like really pushed on the mask when i had the lipstick on and there was absolutely no transfer um i did get a couple of comments from people saying that they found that the lipsticks didn't last very long on them i don't know why because these honestly dried down like completely and they lasted really long on me the only time i found that they lifted off was when i was eating but that was bolognese which is quite like an oily dinner so it was then that i felt that they lifted off but other than that like i really did feel like they had amazing staying power um so yeah not gonna ramble on i'll just get straight into it so i'm gonna test the nude one first and then i'll do red and then the darker one so this is the lipstick in the shade bow and arrow i'm just gonna quickly line my lips just like so so this is the mac cork lip liner just in case anyone's interested it's my absolute go-to liner like, i absolutely love this shade it goes really well with all nudes um also forgot to mention that you actually don't need a lot of this so like a little really does go a long way um so yeah this is the shade bow and arrow i'll go ahead and put it on for you so yeah this is a definite go-to shade for me i'd wear it like with natural makeup glam makeup um so yeah, and I will also just show you, so here is a clean mask. And apart from my foundation that's imprinted around it, like there's absolutely no imprinting whatsoever. Um, yeah, so I will go ahead and try the next two shades on. So yeah, I've just taken that shade off, which by the way, like, I don't know how people can say it comes off easily when it is really hard to get off. I did have to use a little simple oil cleanser which I absolutely love like this dissolves all makeup by the way so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and quickly line my lips with a red pencil and then I'm gonna go ahead and add the shade so this is in the shade outlaw and it is like a perfect red shade so it is really nice bear with me so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop this on And again, just like the uh, nude shade that I just put on, this is so highly pigmented. It just goes on so, so nicely and dries down really nicely. Um, so yeah, this is another one that I would definitely, definitely use. So I'm gonna go ahead and remove this and then the final shade is in Vampira and this is like the perfect dark shade. Like all three of these shades just give completely different looks. I'm, I absolutely love them um so yeah i'm just going to quickly go and remove this and then i'll put the final shade on so i've just gone ahead and outlined my lips which to be honest i think might be a little too light for this shade um but it doesn't really matter because as i said these are like so full coverage and they push up really nicely towards the lip line anyway um and also i did actually use this this shade and the bow and arrow shade to create a, an ombre look the other day and they work so so nicely together um so yeah this is what the shade looks like it does look like a really dark like ready purple here so i'll just go ahead and pop it on so you can see what it looks like
So yeah, this is the final shade, another really, really nice shade that is also pigmented and dries down super nice. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really pleased with these lipsticks. Like this is definitely a range that I would look into and get more shades because I just feel like they're perfect matte lipsticks really. Um, so yeah, I hope the video has been helpful for you. If you've got any questions, then please do just let me know in the comments. Um, please also subscribe to my channel and check me out on TikTok and Instagram and I will see you in the next video.